everybody, let me hear how excited you are to be here tonight. Oh. I think we can do better. Why don't you stand up and tell me how good, how happy you are to be here tonight. Let me hear it. I'm just as happy as you are, and I am so happy to see all of you. I'm Lauren. If you don't know me, everybody say hi, Lauren. We're going to say hi, kids. We are going to have so much fun tonight. Who is excited? Let me see with your hands. I am very excited. We have a couple of things, so we're going to start with an icebreaker game. Everybody go, ooh. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. Can I have two people to help me demonstrate? our icebreaker game. Well, we are so happy to have you. That's why we're gonna demonstrate it. We're gonna show you how we're gonna play the game. Okay, Grayson, okay, come on up. Just run up on the stairs. Okay, and Kate. So I'm, they're gonna show you the game that we're gonna do, okay? And then we all get to do it. It's super awesome. All right, everybody, give me a little cheer for my helpers. <laughs> Woo! Okay, here's the game. It's a mixture of Simon Says, and it's a cup game. So can you grab one cup? Beautiful. Okay, that was the perfect choice. That was the right cup. Come on over. All right, we need to sit it in front of you on the floor. There you go. And Kate, you're going to stand right here. So you're going to face each other. There we go. Okay. And the goal is to be the person to get the cup. But you've got to follow my directions before I say it. So if I said ears, both of them would cover their ears. Cover your ears. If I said knees, both of them would put their hands on their knees. If I said head, both of them would put their hands on their head, like Simon says, right? But if I said cup, oh, it's a fight. One person's got to get the cup. Voila, Kate was the one. And we all go, woohoo! All right? And then we'll pass, we'll find another partner, and we'll play a few rounds to see who can be the ultimate cup person. Does this sound fun? Okay, you two can run down. Everybody give them a round of applause. They did fabulous. Okay, so I want all the kids to come up into this front area. Don't touch the cups yet. Don't touch the cups yet. Okay, I need you to find a partner. And here's what I want you to do. All ears, everybody listen. Whoop. Put your listening ears on. Okay. I want everybody to find a partner. Just find one friend. Find a partner. Hold on, Hannah. Find one partner. Do you have a partner? If you have a partner, raise your hand. Okay, my ladies, my helpers, would you come on over? Okay, so if once you have a partner, you and your partner need one cup. Grab your cup and go out into the altar place. All right, pick your cup. It's a great pick. Find a friend, find one cup. Girls, can you make sure they're all finding friends? Did you find your partner? Okay. All right, once you have your cup, face each other like Kate and Grayson did. Put the cup between you. If you don't have a partner, if we can have some volunteers make sure all of our kiddos have a partner, that'd be fabulous. Okay. We're gonna give like a 10 second countdown to find our partner. You have a partner? You guys have partners? Perfect. Are you ready? Let me hear you if you're ready. Woo! Okay, so put your cup down between you. Oh, I love it. I see people doing exactly what I've asked. It's perfect. Okay, are you ready? Woo! Are you ready? Okay, head, feet. I'm not flexible enough. Knees, hips, head, ears, cup. Woo! Victorious. Okay, everybody pause. All right, we're gonna try it again with the same partner we had, so go ahead and put your cup back on the ground. Okay, are you ready? Are you ready? Woohoo! Okay, are you ready? Eyes, ears, knees, toes, knees, toes, head. Some of you are really low. Head, ears, knees, cup. Ah! All right, okay, here's what I want you to do. I want you to find a new, hold on, listen. Turn your listening ears on. Okay. 
I want you to find a new partner. Find a new partner in five seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. You have a partner? Okay, that's fine. Are you ready? Yes? Okay. Head. Hips. Nose. Eyes. Feet. Knees. Hips. Shoulders. Ears. Cup. Ah, that was awesome. We're gonna do one more round before we move on. Are you ready? Okay, we're gonna do it. We are gonna do ultra speed. We're gonna put this fast forward, are you ready? I don't even know if I can talk this fast. Are you ready? Feet, knees, feet, shoulders, ears, head, ears, knees, toes, 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 cup. <laughs> awesome. Did you break? That's okay. Do you want to do it one more time? Okay. We are excited to be here. Okay. Find a new partner. Someone you've never talked to before. And I want you to introduce yourself. Find a new partner. Someone you don't know. And tell them what your name is. Say hi, my name is. And tell them your name. I love it. We're making new friends. Are you ready? Okay. I love it. All right, shoulders. Feet. Shoulders. Ears. Head. Nose. I said nose, put it back down, it was nose. Oh, we're gonna have to repent later, it's okay. Oh no, ears, hair. Oh, I switched it up. Feet, head, arms up to Jesus. Cup! <laughs> All right. Okay. All right, so if you will bring your cup back up here and my helpers will collect my cups, I want everyone to stay, stay standing facing me. We're gonna do a really cool song, so if I can help my helpers up here. We are gonna do an action song which means we've got motions. Oh wait, don't go sit down. Come back up. Now, I need you to make some space. Make sure you've got some space. Hold on, girls. Have some space. All right, make sure you have some space. We are gonna do a song, not up here. We are gonna do a really fun song that most of our kids know. You know the Na 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 song? Okay, so adults, parents, People out there in the crowd, we want to see you doing this too. It's good exercise. If we're up here, we want you out there. Let me hear it. Woohoo! All right. Facing me, you'll see the words, and I want you to follow along with us as we go through this. Sounds good? Woohoo! All right, let's go.
Oh, yeah. Why don't we give Jesus the biggest hand clap, everybody? Somebody shout, too. Let me hear you make some noise really loud. Oh, yeah. That is awesome. That is awesome. Anybody excited to be at our, at our, at our, at our fall kids revival tonight? You guys pumped up? You guys excited to be here? Yeah? Sweet, sweet. We're going to have some fun. It's going to be a good time. I'm super excited to be here. Um, uh, before, we, before we move forward, though, I need to do a little exercise, okay, just to make sure that everybody's warmed up. For those of you who don't know who I am, my name is Nate. Everybody say, hey, Nate. All right, so if you don't know me, then, then, then that's, that's who I am. I want to be, meet everybody else as well, so I need everybody to shout your name on the count of three really, really loud, okay? You ready? Here we go. One, two, three. Okay, that was a little late, but that's okay. That's great. That's fine. I think somebody just went, ah! I didn't get anything from that, so, but oh well, that's great, that's awesome. Well, nice to meet you guys, that, that's, that's fantastic, so good to be here. How many of you have never seen me before? Raise your hand. How many of you guys, you have no idea who I am, you've never seen me before, okay, cool. How many of you uh, have seen me before? Maybe, maybe we've hung out before, okay, cool, awesome, awesome. How many of you would like to never see me again? Just go ahead and throw those. <laughs> Got, all right. Y'all meet me outside after. No, okay, we're not. We're not. Okay, sorry. All right. All right. But, uh, but man, I'm excited to be here. So I, I want to do a little warm-up, little exercise just to get us all pumped up and make sure that we're loose and that we're good to go. We did awesome in that action song just there, but I want to make sure we're still good, okay? You guys ready? All right. Super easy. It goes like this. Ready? Oh, clap your hands. There we go. Okay. Right. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I, I forgot to, to clarify this. Whenever I say, oh, clap your hands, your job is to clap your hands four times. Everybody say four times. No, you got to say it with some attitude. Say four times. Okay, there we go. You're a little too good at that. You guys need to relax, okay? Here we go, four times. Oh, clap your hands. Okay. Some of you can't count. That's fine. We're going to ignore that, all right? Now stomp your feet. One, two, three, four. There you go. Slap on your knees. One, two, three, four. Get out of your seat. Okay, all right, all right. Well, let's sit back down. That got, that got awkward. Okay. All right, so whenever I say get out of your seat, your job is to stand up really fast, throw your hands in the air, go, woo, and sit right back down as fast as you can. All right, can you guys do that? Let's try it out real quick. Get out of your seat. There we go. The last part it goes like this. Shout hallelujah. Amen. Amen. There you go. You guys give yourselves a hand. I think y'all got it. You got it. That's awesome. All right, let's try to put it all together. We're going to put it all together. Here we go. Oh, clap your hands. Now stomp your feet, slap on your knees, get out of your seat, shout hallelujah, amen. Okay, very good, very good, very good, all right. Uh, here, here's the thing though, I, I think we need to have a little contest, okay? Uh, we played a little game just a second ago, but I think we, we need to have a little bit of guys versus the girls, all right? I think that's only fair, all right? So, so here's what we're gonna do, here's what we're gonna do, all right? Gentlemen, you have to be gentlemen, so we're gonna do ladies first. All right, so all the guys, don't say anything, don't, do, don't make noise because you don't want them to be louder than you are, okay? So all of my guys, I need you to stay quiet, just chill out, hang out there, pick your nose, whatever you want to do, okay? So just relax, all right? Not literally, stop, okay? Oh my goodness, all right? So, uh, but here we go, just the ladies, just the girls, all right? Girls, y'all ready? Y'all th think y'all can be louder and better than the boys? Yeah? All right, okay, let's see, here we go. Oh, clap your hands, now stomp your feet, slap on your knees, Get out of your seat. Shout hallelujah. Amen. Girls, give yourself a big round of applause. That was awesome. That was so awesome. Good stuff. All right, now. Boys. Now the men. All right. Are you ready? Guys, I said, are you ready? <laughs> I was wondering what that was for a second. Men, are you ready? I didn't know what was happening, okay? That's all right. That's okay. We're going to work on that. Okay. All right. So just the guys this time, all the girls, stay there, stay quiet, just chill out, pick your friend's nose, whatever you want to do, okay? All right. Just the guys. Just the guys. All right. All right. Here we go, guys. Oh, clap your hands. Now stomp your feet. Slap on your knees. Get out of your seat. Shout hallelujah. Amen. That's what I'm talking about. Boys, give yourselves a hand. That was awesome. That was good stuff. All right, everybody, everybody. All right, but here's the deal. Everybody together, I think we can do it a little bit faster. You guys think we can be faster? I think we can. All right, let's try it out. Here we go. Oh, clap your hands. Now stomp your feet. Slap on your knees. Get out of your seat. Shout hallelujah. Amen. I don't know what happened at the end there, but that was. <laughs> Shout hallelujah. Started barking at me. I don't know what that was, man. 
Okay. <laughs> Here we go. Let's try it again. Keep it real fast. Oh, clap your hands. Now stomp your feet. Stop on your knees. Get out of your seat. Shout hallelujah. Amen. Oh, clap your hands. Now stomp your feet. Stop on your knees. Get out of your seat. Shout hallelujah. Amen. Oh, clap your hands. Now stomp your feet. Stop on your knees. Oh, clap your hands. Guys, what are you doing? I said, clap your hands. What was that? Ah! ah, ah. I was like, what are you doing? <laughs> All right. Let's try it again. Let's try it again. Oh, clap your hands. Now stomp your feet. Stop on your knees. Stop on your neighbor's knees. Stop on your other neighbor's knees. There you go. Now get up, find that one person you don't like and slap them in the face. No, 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 don't, 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 no, stop, 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 stop. No, don't, don't do that. Please don't, I'm sorry, pastor. Yeah, don't do that. Don't do that at all, okay? All right. Some of our adults in the back were like, I've been waiting on this moment. No, it's not happening tonight, okay? I'm sorry, all right? Okay, here we go, here we go. Let's try it again. Oh, clap your hands. Now stomp your feet, slap on your knees. Get out of your seat. Get out of your seat. Last time, as big as you can, get out of your seat. Shout hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Chicken. Hallelujah. No, guys, no. No, it's amen. You're supposed to say amen. That's what you're supposed to say. So it's hallelujah. Hey, I didn't say chicken. You said chicken, okay? So it's hallelujah. Amen. Just repeat after me. That was funny, though, okay? Let's try it again. Hallelujah. Amen. There you go. Hallelujah. Bacon. Yeah. How, guys, are you serious? Guys, what was that? No, it's, it's amen. That's all you have to say. You just repeat after me. I didn't say it. You said it. I don't know what you're talking about. No, it's amen. It's a, stop lying in the church. Okay. All right. Let's try it again. It's your last chance. All right. It's your last chance. And we're done. <laughs> okay. All right. Hallelujah. Amen. Let's try it again. Here we go. Hallelujah. Amen. See? Hallelujah. That's all you got to do. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I haven't taken a shower in three weeks. That's disgusting. And I don't know why you guys would shout that out loud, but that's gross. Okay. All right. Y'all make sure you're the first ones in the altar tonight, okay? So we can push them out of the way, okay? You guys give Jesus the biggest hand clap of praise. You guys are awesome. <laughs> you guys are too cool. All right, everybody stand up on your feet. I want to teach you guys this action song really quick. It's super, super easy. So we're going to sing this out loud. We're going to do these motions together again. Super easy. Anybody glad that you're set free tonight? You guys glad that we're free in Jesus? Yeah? So this song is called Free Indeed. It's super easy. It goes like this. We're going to say who the sun sets free. There you go. Is free. free. Indeed. Indeed. Who the sun sets free. Is free. free. Indeed. Indeed. Yeah. There you go. You guys got it. You've already won the victory. Very good. But whenever you have victory up like this, we're going to go like this. You ready? There you go. Just like you do in church. That's it. That's it. There you go. Waymaker, miracle. We don't do that. Okay. All right. You've already won. There you go. It all, we're going to spin like this. For me. Now, whenever we say for me, what we're going to do is we're going to cross our arms. We're going to face this way. And we're going to go like this. This is normal. Don't act like you don't do this all the time, okay? All right. All right. And then we're going to stick our hands out and we're going to go, eh, 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 eh. Can you guys do that? Let's try it one time. Here we go. Eh, eh, eh. You guys got it. And then we're going to stick our arms out. We're going to spin the other way. And we're going to do it again. We're going to cross our arms and bounce like this. And then we're going to say, eh, eh, eh. You guys got it. All right. So then the bridge, we're going to say, I am free. This way, free indeed. I am free. Because you said, because you said, I am. Like that. And then we're going to add a little bit more uh, moves to it. We're going to do our hands like this. We're going to go like this, this way. There you go. Then we're going to face this way and do it again. All right, we're going to do one I really like. We're just going to kind of like lean back a little bit, face this way and lean back. You're just going to let your arms just kind of dangle there, and you're going to go like this. All right, there you go. Normal, okay? You guys do that in the altar. Don't lie, okay? So we're going to do like that. And then, uh, and then if you guys, uh, uh, you, it's, it's not that popular of a move. Have you guys ever heard of this thing called the floss? You guys ever heard about that? Yeah? 
Yeah? Well, we're not going to do that because that's ridiculous. Okay. So um, <laughs> maybe. I'll pray about it. I'll pray about it. All right. You guys ready to be free indeed? All right. I, I, need, I need real quick, though. Can I have two helpers come up here and help me do this? Is that okay? All right. And the plaid shirt on the second row. You were the first one to have your Yeah, come on up, come on up, run on up here, run on up here. Make some noise for him. Give him a big hand. Give him a big hand. Right here in the LSU, I mean the Ohio State, sorry, the, the Ohio State shirt. Y'all go ahead and come on up. Y'all coming up, coming up. Give him a big hand. Make some noise for him. Put it up for him. Y'all come help me out. Y'all look awesome. What is up? How's it going? How's it going, man? What's up? You stand on this side for me if you want to stand over there. Awesome. What is, what is your name? Grayson. Grayson, awesome, nice to meet you. Everybody say, what's up, Grayson? What's up? All right, what is your name? Kate. Kate, this is Kate. Everybody say, what's up, Kate? What's up, Kate? Is Kate really your name? For real? That's my mom's name. That's really your name? That's so cool, that's awesome. All right, everybody say, what's up, Kate? That's cool, that's my mom's name. All right, all right, cool. So, uh, so we're gonna do this song. You guys ready? You guys got it already? No? Well, you better get ready pretty fast, okay? Here we go. Let's do it. Go ahead and roll that in Jesus' name. Here we go. Here we go. This way first. This way. There you go. You got it. This way again. Do the same. You've already. You've already. Say the victory. Alright, 
kids, you guys ready? Here we go. Stop it, I don't want to do it anymore. Quick, wait, wait. <laughs> you said. Have it up real big, say, I am free. Randy. Yeah. I am free. Because you said. One more time, clap it up, say, I am free. Free me. I am. Because you said, say, because you said. If you're glad you're free, make some noise for Jesus. Come on, guys. Give it up for Kate and Grayson. Didn't they do awesome? Wasn't that so good? That was good. Thank you, guys. I guess I stink because Grayson kept scooting further and further away from anybody notice that. <laughs> it was like slowly making my distance there. <laughs> that was awesome. That was good stuff. Awesome. How many of you guys have a favorite Bible story? Throw up your hand. You guys got a favorite Bible story. Awesome. Uh, so many of you don't read the Bible. Cool. Perfect. That'll work. <laughs> All right. So uh, I, I love the Bible. I love the Word of God. I love uh, diving into it and just getting to see how the Word stands out and pops out to me. And, and one of my favorite Bible stories that I've ever had is the story of David and Goliath. Anybody like the story of David and Goliath? You guys like that one? So that's my favorite Bible story, but here's the deal is whenever I was younger, uh, my parents would teach it to me in different ways, and then as I grew up, and I was always like hyper and crazy acting and all that stuff, uh, I, would, I would learn these stories, and I would teach them in different ways as well to like our Sunday school classes and all of my friends at school and stuff, and so um, I, I learned the story of David and Goliath in a little bit different way than maybe you guys have heard it before. And so um, one, one night, I was, I was about like seven years old and I got this curtain. Anybody ever made a fort like in the kitchen or in the living room, you got like chairs and, and a blanket and all that stuff. So I made this fort, right? And I put these things together and I come up with this skit of that, that's it, that's it, hallelujah. Come on, that's it, run right now. Run for your victory in the name, come on, somebody give them praise, hallelujah. She has no idea we just clap for her. That was awesome. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. Sorry. But, uh, but anyway, so I, I put this curtain over and, and I performed this skit for my parents. And, and I was like, so this is the story of David and Goliath. Da, 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 and I acted out both of the parts. And I showed my mom and my dad. And they were like, don't ever do that again. So I'm going to do it again because they're not here. Okay. So uh, we're going to do it tonight. But I, I want to share with you guys this version of David and Goliath, if that's okay. Is that cool if, if we do this, do this David and Goliath tonight? So, so here's the deal, though. Um, there, there's, there's two characters, two main characters, David and Goliath, and, and there's one of me. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna come out on one side as David, and then I'll come out on the other side as Goliath, and I'll, I'll do my best to try to play both of those parts, if, if that's cool. So we'll, we'll see if we can do that, all right? If you guys are ready for the story of David and Goliath, I need you to clap your hands really, really big, and everybody shout, yeah. yeah. All right, <clears throat> ladies and gentlemen, the story of David and Goliath. Here we go. David.
Thank you. Hey. Anybody else having an asthma attack right now? Just me? Okay. I'm just wondering. All right. So um, uh, I, I want to teach you guys one more action song real quick, if that's okay. Everybody get up, go, go ahead and get up on your feet, and I'm going to need two more helpers to help me out with this. Give them a big hand, everybody. Make some noise for them both. Whew. All right. Go ahead and sit over here for me. Awesome. What is your name? Ollie. Ollie. Ollie, Ollie Oxenfree? Horrible joke. Sorry. Okay. Ollie, nice to meet you. Everybody say, what's up, Ollie? This is Ollie. What is your name, sweetie? Isa. Isa? For real? Isa? Are you serious? That's my mom's name. That's crazy. Um... Everybody, everybody say, hey, Issa. Awesome. Issa, you look awesome. All right. Uh, Ollie, you look awesome. Okay, so we're going to do this song super, super easy, but now I have to explain. There's a pretty dangerous move that goes with this song, okay? Um, so be careful when you do this, all right? So the first thing that we're going to do is we're going to throw our hands up like this, okay? We're going to bend our knees just a little bit, just like that. All right, there you go. And uh, we're going to spread our legs just a tad. There you go. Or not, Ollie, whatever you want to do, okay? All right? 
So we're gonna <laughs> we're gonna do like that. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and uh, kind of like point your knees out, just like this. There you go. This is normal. This is normal. Don't act like this ain't normal. Okay. All right. So you're gonna be like this. You're gonna raise one hand. Okay. You're gonna raise the opposite leg, like this. All right. There you go. Don't bail on me yet, parents. Don't bail on me yet, okay? <laughs> all right, you're gonna put that back down. You're gonna do the same thing the opposite way, just like that. All right, there you go. Okay, now you're gonna put both of those together and you're gonna do this. You ready? All right, careful, careful, careful. Don't hurt anybody, all right? It's dangerous, it's tough, okay? All right, I'm, I'm telling you it's dangerous because say, say uh, like you can use it to do good or you can use it to do harm, right? So Ollie, let's say you're at school and there's this beautiful girl, right? And you're like, excuse me, miss. I would like to take you on an eloquent date. To McDonald's. And I was wondering if you would be my wife. I don't know why wife, <laughs> all right? And then the girl looks at you kind of like that and she goes, And you look at her and you go, are you sure? <laughs> All right. All of you do that, she's gonna say yes every time, okay? All right, kids, you can use it to do some damage as well. Say you're at school again, right? And, uh, and there's this bully, there's this person that won't leave you alone. And they walk up to you right in the middle of the school hall and they're like, hey, you better give me your money right now. You look at them and you say, hey. <laughs> you're just like that, okay? You got it, you got it, he said. Now, one of two things are gonna happen when you do that, okay? Number one, they're gonna run away. They're never gonna mess with you again, yeah? The second thing that could happen is uh, you're gonna get beat up. But either way, it works, okay? Either way, it's very effective, all right? So we're gonna do that move. We're gonna glorify his name just like that. We're gonna jog this way just a little bit, okay? Jog like this. We're gonna jog the other way like this, okay? We're gonna raise it up, we're gonna jump and raise it up, say that's why he came. And then we're gonna cup our hands, we're gonna go like this, we're gonna say, oh, oh, oh. Yeah, you guys got it. If you guys are ready to glorify his name, let me hear you clap your hands and let's give him some praise today, let's do it. You guys ready? All right, here we go. Gave us heavenly breath like this. First, here we go. You gave a heavenly breath and now it's there in our chest. That's why we're singing it back to you. One hand this way. For every battle Other you hand. want. For everything that you've done. And everything that you've done. Go. All right, clap it up like this. Here we go. Sword through the sky just like this. There you go. Everybody, we're flying real high. There you go. Awesome. Oh, we gotta speed up the plane a little bit. Alright, you ready? Here we go. Hands up, hands up. Last time, last time, real man. You ready? This way, this way. Clap your hands real big, real big. 
And let's do it real fast for Jesus Christ, everybody. Come on. Oh, yeah. Give it up for Ollie and Issa. Didn't they do awesome? It is so good. Thank you, guys. Y'all can be seated as well. Man, you guys are too awesome, man. Whew. High five like two people beside you and just tell them God is good. Just let them know. Oh, yeah. All right, real quick. Um, I, I, I got a friend of mine that I want to bring out. I'm very glad to have my wife here with me tonight, but I have another friend that I want to bring out just to say hey and say what's up to everybody really, really quick. Uh, he, he likes to... It is the pig. Yes, it is. That's right, Kate. That's it. So, um, but but the, this friend of mine, this pig, uh, his name's Stephen, and uh, I just wanted to bring out just to say, hey, and what's up to everybody? Just really, really quick, if that's okay. Is that fine if we get Stephen out? Is that okay? Are you guys sure? Are you positive? Okay. Uh, let me see if I can find him. You guys just just uh, just give him. Well, well, let me just see if first if I can get him real quick. I think I put him. Yeah. Okay. All right. So you guys go ahead and give Stephen a big hand, everybody. Make some noise for him. Keep him in this very professional pet co box right here. Buy it at your standard store. Awesome. All right. Everybody, this is Steven. Everybody say, hey, Steven. Yeah. Steven, tell everybody hello. Hola. No, don't say, say hello. Hola. That's no, great. Say hello. Hola. No, say hello. Hola. Okay, say, say it. So, so that's, Steven, we know that's Spanish, but not everybody knows Spanish, so we're just going to say hello. Hola. No, we're going to say hello. Hola. Steven, we're going to say hello. Hola. Okay, all right. Steven, say he, he. No, say low. No. Come on, say he, he. No, say low. Low. Say hello, hola. Okay, it's not working. Um, uh, so hey, reverse psychology. Steven, say say hola, hola. Okay, it didn't work. All right, but uh, anyways, Steven, uh, we're excited to be here. You guys having a good time tonight? You guys are having fun so far, yeah. So so we've danced, we've had a blast, and uh, and we've had we've had a lot of fun, and, and we're excited to be here. They're excited to be here. Steven, I know you're. I thought God was coming back. No, he's, he's not. That's not. I don't think that's how the trumpet sounds, but I mean, it could be. Uh, but, uh, but no, so, so Stephen, um, here's, here's the deal, okay? Uh, I, I know that we're excited. We're pumped up to be here, right? No. No, yes, we are. We're very glad. We're excited. You are. I'm not. <laughs> Stephen, we're glad to be here with all of our friends. No, we're not. Yes, we are. We're glad to be here with them, okay? With, with all of our friends. They're not your friends. What do you mean they're not my friends? Do you know their names? I mean, I know like a couple of them. I know like Issa and Ollie and, and I know Grayson. I know like, I know Cade. I know like a few of their names. Yeah. Do you know all their names? No, I don't know all of their names. No. Then they're not your friend. Can I get like two more names and will you be good then? Yeah. Okay, good. All right, let me get, let me get like two more names really, really quick, uh, if that's okay. In the, in, the, in the front, yes, you just look down. Wait, well, two of you like, yeah, you just stood up. What's your, what's your name? What is it? Addy. Is that right? Like, like with the D, Addy, like that? Okay. All right. So that's Addy. Addy. Okay. All right. Now let me get one more. Hello. Okay. Focus. All right. So uh, let me get one more in the, in the yellow shirt on the front as well. What's your name, buddy? What is it? Emmett? Emmett. Okay. Very cool. All right. So, so this is Emmett. Emmett. Okay. Good. All right. So we got, we got Addy. Addy. Okay. And we have Emmett. All right. Hey, girl. Okay. Quit. All right. <laughs> focus. All right. So we have Addy, all right, and then we have Emmett, okay? Emmett, okay, good. Now, who am I? Dada. Da. No, I'm not, no, I'm not your dad, no. No, who, who, who am I? Nanny. I'm not your nanny, I don't babysit you, okay? No, uh, Stephen, who do I look like? Grandma. That's not, no, it's not true. I, my, my name is Nate. Nate, okay, good, yeah, so, so I'm Nate, and who are you? Nate. No, you're... You're, you're Steven. Technically, I'm Nate. That doesn't matter right now. You're Steven, okay? All right, so Steven. Steven, okay, good. Now, who's this over here? Addy. Okay, great. Who's this over here? Hey. Okay, who is this right here? We're, get, we're getting names, okay? So we got Addy, and then who is this? Nate. No, I'm Nate. That's Emmett, all right? So Emmett, in it. okay, who am I? Steven. No, you're Steven. I'm Nate. You're Steven, okay? That's Emmett, all right? So who's this over here? The love of the night life. Okay, who, no, 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 no. No, she's not. Yes, she is. No, she's not, okay? It's just, it's just Addie, all right? I love you. Stop. We're not telling her we love her, okay? I'm sorry, Addie. I apologize, okay? So this is Addie, all right? And this is Emmett, okay? So can you say in it? No, Addie. Okay. 
Focus, all right? Please, okay? So we have Addy. Addy. Okay, we have Emmett. In it. Okay, who am I? In it. No, that's Emmett over there, all right? I'm Nate. That's Emmett, okay? All right, so, so who am I? I don't care. Hey, Addy. Okay, stop. Can you please... Can you please focus, all right? We're just getting names. I'm Nate, you're Steven. Steven, okay, great. Now, who's this over here? My girlfriend. She's not your girlfriend. She's not, okay? Addie, I'm so sorry, okay? What is her name? Who is she? My fiance. She's not your fiance, Steven. What is her name? My wife. She's not your wife. Steven, listen. She's not your wife, she's not your girlfriend, she's not your fiance, she's not the love of your life, Steven. You're not together and she's never gonna date you. Why? Because you're a pig. <gasps> What? You're a pig. No, that's not what I meant, Stephen. No, Stephen, I mean you're literally a pig. You're literally a cow. That's not what I meant. Whatever, okay? So, so Stephen, please, we're just getting names, all right? So who is this over here? My ex-girl. She's not your ex-girlfriend. <laughs> Quit, all right? Thank you. Please focus, all right? So, so who is this right here? Just say, say her name. Her name. No, don't literally say her name. Like, what is her name? Eddie. Okay, good. All right, who's this over here? Nate. No, Emmett. In it. Okay, good. Who am I? Nate. All right, and who are you? I am your father. Okay, no, that's weird. That's weird. <laughs> Don't say that. That's weird. All right, this is not Star Wars. Okay, all right, so again, really, really quick. All right, who's this over here? Eddie. Okay, good. Who's this? In it. All right, who am I? Da -da. No. <laughs> no. Who am I? Nate. Okay, good. And you are? Nate, <laughs> just say Steven, Steven. Okay, good, all right, good job. All right, now, now Steven, here's the thing. Yeah, here's the thing. Uh, we're, we're gonna do some stuff here in just a second, but before I show everybody this last thing that I wanna show them, uh, I want us to understand something about what the word of God tells us that we have to do, okay? Okay, all right, so the Bible says that we've gotta repent of our sins. Repel? No, not repel, we have to repent, or tell. What do dogs have to do with it? Bugs don't have anything to do with it because it's not repel, it is repent. Now, whenever you repent, what you do is you pray and you ask God to forgive you of all your sins. Now, it doesn't mean that you're a bad person. You're just asking God to forgive you and you do your best to never do that again, all right? And then the Bible, Lord! Okay, uh, then the Bible says, God! Stephen, what are you doing? I'm repenting. No, we're not repenting right now. We're gonna repent together here in just a little bit, okay? All right, so uh, after we repent the Bible, God! Stephen, Stephen, we're repenting later now. Okay, can you please hurry up at least? Oh God, I'm so sorry. Okay, you're so sorry? That I fell in love with Addie. Okay, no, you can't. You can't repent for falling in love with Addie, okay? That's not how that works, all right? Steven, if you repent for that, that means you can never fall in love with her again. You do understand that, right? Huh? You can't fall in love with her again because you repented for it. I take it back. No, that's not how it works, okay? You can't do that. All right, so anyways, you repent of your sin, you never do it again. Then you gotta get baptized in the name of Jesus Christ. That's where all those sins that you just asked God to forgive you for, they're all washed away. So you gotta get baptized. Yeah, 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 yeah. You gotta get baptized. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can you say baptized? I am. Yeah, yeah. No, we, we're saying baptized. Yeah, yeah. No, Stephen, what are you doing? I'm saying you said. That's not what I said. I said baptized. I know. Yeah, yeah. Stephen, say baptized. Yeah, yeah. Say baptized. Yeah, yeah. Say baptized. 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 Yeah, yeah. Okay, <laughs> whatever. So you, you, you get baptized in Jesus' name. Yeah, yeah. In Jesus' name. That's not, all right, whatever. Anyways, so you, you come out of the water a brand new creature in Christ. Huh? You come out of the water a new creature. You're like made, made new. You're made whole. I could be a deer. No, you can't be a deer. That's not what that means, okay? Uh, you're, you're like a brand new Stephen. A goat. <laughs> That's not what that means. No, you, you can't be, a good, you're, you're a new pig, you're a new Stephen, all the old stuff is washed away, and then you're filled with the baptism of the Holy Ghost. No! <laughs> Stephen, what is your deal? I don't like ghosts! No, it's not, Stephen, it's not that kind of ghost, Stephen. It's, it's the Holy Ghost. I don't care if he goes to church or not, I don't like him! No, that's not, the Holy Ghost doesn't mean it's a ghost that goes to church. Stephen, the Holy Ghost, it's, it's God's spirit. Can you, can you get out of my arm, please? Your armpit stinks, then don't get in there! I'm sorry, guys. <sighs> did you wear deodorant? I did wear deodorant, okay. Don't smell like it. So 
So the Holy Ghost, just saying, okay, quit, all right, please. The Holy Ghost is God's spirit. It's, it's, it's the spirit of God. When he comes in your life, he, he moves inside of your heart. It's the greatest thing that we could ever receive. And, it, and you receive it with the evidence of speaking in other tongues. It's, it's better than, than any basketball shot. It's better than, uh, than, 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 than winning all the money in the world and having the biggest house and driving the nicest cars. It's, it's the greatest gift that you could ever receive in this world. And the world can't give it to you and the world can't take, away, t- take it away from you. It's, it's, it's the best thing that we could ever receive. Does it hurt? What do you mean, does it hurt? That's a full-grown man in your heart. No, that's not what that means. It's not a full-grown man in your heart. Again, it's his spirit that is inside of your heart. He's in your heart. Yes, he's in my heart right now. Yes, he's in my heart right now, okay? So our goal tonight is that... (laughs) Stephen, what are you doing? I'm listening. What do you mean you're listening? I'm listening for Jesus. No, Stephen, you're not going to hear Jesus like that. Not if you don't stop talking. Can you please hurry up at least? Shh. Okay, all right. Stephen, seriously, which? Guys, please don't ag him on, please. Seriously, that's. Stephen, can you hurt? Okay, all right. I think I can hear him. Huh? I think I can hear him. You think you can hear Jesus right now? Yep. Okay, well, what's, what's Jesus saying? Dum, 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 dum. No, Stephen, Stephen, that's my heart. No, it's not. He's playing the drums. He's not playing the drums, okay? You guys give Stephen a big round of applause. Everybody make some noise for him. Awesome. Thank you so much, Stephen. Okay, guys, I, I, got, I got one more thing that I want to I wanna share with you guys really, really quick, okay? I'm sorry. Okay, I'm sorry. Just Stephen, Stephen, yeah? Are you, are you talking? Like, what is your deal? I just want to say I'm sorry. Okay, you're sorry for what? What, what are you sorry for? I'm sorry if they're saying your arm tits stinks. Okay. Well, thank you. I appreciate that. All right, that's, that's, that's very nice of you, okay? And I'm sorry if they're saying you got a dick nose. <laughs> Steven, you didn't say it had a big nose. Oh. Okay, whatever. Uh, is, is there anything else? Because we, we, we got we to gotta hurry. Is there anything else that you want to say? Mm-hmm. Okay, what else? What, what, what is it? Eddie, I still love you. Okay, no, we're not, we're not doing that. Okay, we're not. All right, sorry. Sorry, Eddie, I apologize. Okay. All right, guys, let's give Stephen one more big round of applause, everybody. Give it up for him. All right, I got, I got one more thing I want to share with you guys really, really quick, if that's okay. I'm just going to scoot this over here. Just like this, if that's all right, everybody. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, I'm so excited to share this with you guys. I put all these things in here that I'm pumped up to share with you, and I can't wait to show you guys this. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, it is none other than a box. Stop, stop. It's not worth it. It's, it's too late. Okay. All right. So, but this is not just any box. All right. This is a box of everything that you have when you don't have Jesus. It's a box of everything you have when you don't have Jesus. So I've taken a whole lot of time. I've put a whole bunch of stuff inside of here, a box of everything you have when you don't have Jesus. And so at the top of this box here, the very first thing that you'll find in this box is, is, is uh, okay. This is, this is embarrassing. Uh, who, who, Kate, did you get up there whenever, did you get up there inside of that box whenever you came up and did an action song? Did you like get stuff out of this whenever you're up there? No, don't lie, Kate. Are you serious? I saw you, I saw you looking at it, okay? Whenever you, all right, whatever. But I, I could have sworn, I could have sworn that it was inside of this thing. I, I'm sorry, guys. I, I put a whole lot of stuff inside of this box and I, ah! All right, sorry. Okay, I didn't realize. I thought you were in there. That really freaked me out for a second. Okay. All right. So uh, maybe it's the uh, maybe it's the can. Yeah. So uh, it's not it's not a box. It's a, a can of everything you have. So I got a can of everything that you have when you don't have Jesus. And so I put everything inside of this just for you guys tonight. And I'm so excited to share this with you guys. So everything you have when you don't have Jesus at the very top of this can. The first thing that we. Kate, are you kidding me right now? This is the second one, okay? This is, this is what I get, man, I tell you. This is, guys, I am so sorry. This is embarrassing, I promise, guys. I had, I had something in here. I'm not sure who, who took this or who, but, ah! Okay, sorry, sorry, Timmy Turner. I thought you were in there, okay? All right, okay, my bad, all right. Uh, so maybe, maybe it wasn't, uh, maybe it's not the can. It's a, uh, it's a, it's a, that's right. It's the, it's, it's the box, guys. I got, a, I got a box of everything you have when you, when you don't, I get, it's not funny. If you could please stop laughing, that'd be, 
Um, it's, uh, it's, it's, uh, it's a can. It's a can of everything you, when you, um, actually, guys, you know what? That's, that's, that's actually right. Cause, cause when you don't have Jesus, you don't have anything at all. You know, it, 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 it doesn't matter how much money you have or, or, or how many friends you have or if everything seems to be going your way. If, if Jesus is not in your life or he's not in your heart, then you don't have anything. It doesn't matter. However, we can do what we talked about just a second ago with Stephen and we can, we can repent of our sins and we can ask God to forgive us of our sins and, and we can get baptized in Jesus' name and get filled with the Holy Ghost. And whenever we begin to do those things, we'll, we'll start seeing something that's a little bit different in our life, right? And, and instead of, of nothingness being there before, we'll start seeing some joy and some peace peace and some strength and some hope and, and deliverance and, and God just keeps pouring out his spirit and his blessings upon us and maybe you feel sad a lot of times you don't know why you feel sad and, and Jesus begins to take that and turn it into joy and happiness and, and he fills you with his spirit and just when you think he's done he keeps going and going and going and he just continues to pour out his spirit upon you and he goes and it flows and it flows and then it flows and it just keeps on flowing some more and some more and some more and that is what we have whenever we've got Jesus inside of our hearts. Is anybody in this place glad that we've got a chance to have Jesus in our hearts tonight. Anybody glad about that? If you're glad about that and you love the Lord, why don't you stand to your feet all over this place and let's give Jesus the greatest hand clap of praise that we can right now. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Amen. That's what we have when we have Jesus in us is we got everything that we need and more. If you feel sad, if you feel broken, if you feel hopeless, you've got joy whenever you've got Jesus. If you feel like there, there, there's no reason to wake up tomorrow and give your life over to Jesus, that, that, then when you have him inside of your life, you have that hope. If you feel weak in your spirit or in your body, when you have Jesus, that's that strength that you need and you feel strong. Jesus is the answer to every single thing that we need in our life, no matter what it may be. If you're sad, he gives you joy. If you're weak, he makes you strong. If you feel lonely, he's that friend that sticks closer than any brother or sister a mom or dad or a grandparent ever could because that's how much he loves us, all right? That's awesome. That's awesome. Well, God sticks even closer than, than all those friends you have in your house. That's so cool. Well, here's what I want us to do, guys, okay? I believe that Jesus wants to be within us. He wants to be close with us. He wants to be a part of our lives. And whatever you have need of in this place, I believe that God wants to answer those needs in this house. So here's what I want us to do, all right? Every eye closed, every head bowed, I want us to say a prayer of repentance together, okay? All right, nobody looking around, we're just gonna say this together. We're gonna repent, ask God to forgive us, and we gotta mean this. Don't just repeat after me. We need to make sure that we mean this from our hearts, all right? Everybody say, dear Jesus. See, I come to you tonight, and I ask that you would forgive me of all of my sins. I'm so sorry, Lord. Give you my heart, give you my life, I give you my mind, give you everything so you can be my everything. I love you and I praise your name in Jesus' name. And everybody said amen. Amen. Now that's awesome, but, but, but here's the deal. Just because you repeat after me doesn't mean that you're forgiven. If you meant that with all your heart, then God has forgiven you. But it also doesn't mean that you've been filled with the gift of the Holy Ghost, right? We've still got to get baptized in the name of Jesus. We've still got to get filled with the gift of the Holy Ghost. So here's what I want us to do real quick, okay? If you've got the, uh, the altar music, if you want to go ahead and start playing that, that's totally fine. Now, here, here's what I want us to do, okay? One more time, every eye closed, every head bowed, nobody looking around except for myself and the ministry, the pastor here tonight. And if there's a, 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 the, the children's ministry team, if you guys want to go ahead and come on up here, up to this front as we're getting ready to pray. You guys can go ahead and do that at this time. But everybody else, I want us all to close our eyes, bow our heads. If you have a need tonight, and this can be anything, you've got something that you need God to touch in your life. It, it, it can be maybe you feel sad, and you don't know why you feel sad all the time and you want some joy. Maybe you've got a brother or sister that, that has never come to church with you, and you want them to just come give Jesus a try. Maybe you have some stuff in your house that you deal with in your family and nobody knows about. Maybe, maybe you feel like you're all by yourself and you feel alone and you just want somebody to be there for you. You want a friend, you want somebody to be close with you. Maybe you know somebody in your family, maybe you got a grandma or grandpa that needs a healing. They're sick in their body and they need a touch from God. They need Jesus to heal them right now. 
If that's you, if you've got a need tonight, again, no one looking around, nobody's judging you. You're not in a place where people are gonna judge you or pick on you, but here's what I want you to do. If you have a need tonight, that you want God to touch, I just want you to slip up your hand and that's gonna be your testament that I got, I got something that I need Jesus to touch in my life. That's awesome. That's awesome. You guys go ahead and put those hands down. That's great. God sees those hands as well. Here's the next question, the last question I wanna ask you, all right? If there's anybody in this place that you have not been filled with the gift of the Holy Ghost, it's the greatest gift that we could ever receive with the evidence of speaking in tongues. If you've never been filled with the Spirit, with the evidence of tongues, maybe you've been filled with it before, you know, parents, adults, teens that are here, but it's been quite some time and you just want a renewing of that Spirit. But if you want the Holy Ghost and you want it tonight, if that's you, I want you to slip up your hand if you can do that. Let that be your testament. I want the Holy Ghost. I want God to fill me. That's cool. That's awesome. God sees those hands too. That's great. That's awesome, guys. All right, you go ahead and put those hands down. Here's what we're gonna do, all right? On the count of three, those of you that raised your hands and you said that I need a touch from God, I need Jesus to, to, to do this need and to fill this need for me or I need God to fill me with the gift of the Holy Ghost. Maybe you didn't raise your hand, but you're still saying to yourself, I need God to do something for me. And you feel that tug at your heart like, I'm ready to give everything over to Him. I'm ready to be filled with His Spirit. No, no, no matter who you are, what your age is or, or where you're from, I want you to know right now that Jesus is here. And he's not just here for Nate, okay? He's not just here for these, the, these ministers and these leaders that are up here with you and, and, and these prayer warriors that are up here. He is here for each and every one of you. He's here for every single one of you guys. Whenever you showed up tonight, Jesus was watching you. He was saying, man, I'm glad that they're here because I want to bless them. I want to love them. I want to fill them up. I, wanna, I, I, I want them to feel my presence. All right, so here's what we're going to do. On the count of three, if you raised your hand, said you needed a touch, said you wanted to be filled, whatever it is, whenever I get to three, I want you to come up. Everybody else and everybody in this place, what we're gonna do is we're gonna clap our hands, we're gonna, we're gonna holler, we're gonna scream, we're gonna shout hallelujah, we're gonna take a couple seconds just to praise God for the ones that are coming up here and praying and giving everything over to Him. And we're gonna trust that God's gonna fill somebody with the gift of the Holy Ghost and fill some needs tonight in Jesus' name. Anybody, anybody believe that with me? Amen, somebody say, I believe. Come on, somebody say, I believe, say it real big. I believe, yeah, there we go. Here we go, you guys ready to pray? Come on, I get excited when I get to pray. You guys ready to pray? There we go, that's what I'm talking about. That's awesome, I love to pray, man, it's exciting. Here we go, in Jesus' name. One, two, three. Go ahead and come on up and everybody, let's make some noise for the King of Kings and Lord of Lords and thank God for every one of these students in this place. You guys, go ahead and come on up, come on up. I'm gonna help you pray, I'm gonna help you pray in just a second. You guys, go ahead and come on up, come on up, come on up. Awesome, awesome. And then I want everybody else to know too that it's not too late. At any moment, we want you to come up here and pray. Even if you weren't coming up here for a need, I want everybody to come up here and help us pray for those that are praying and, and, and have a need of Jesus. Our parents, our families, feel free to come on, up and, come on up here if you're comfortable as well, okay? All right, kids, you guys ready to pray? Here we go, everybody say step one. Step one, first thing I need you to do is I need you to close your eyes. Don't look at anybody around you or besides you, all right? We're removing our distractions. I know when we're at kids' revivals and we're hanging out with our friends, we wanna look and see what's going on, but that's exactly why we close our eyes, okay? So we're not distracted. Everybody say step two. Step two with your eyes closed. I want you to take your head and lift up your face towards heaven. There you go. So now we're not, not only we're not worried about anybody that's around us or beside us, but now we're giving Jesus our attention, okay? So, so we're removing our distractions and we're putting our attention on Jesus. Everybody say step three. Come on, real loud, say step three. Step three with our eyes closed and face lifted up. What we're gonna do is we're gonna lift up both hands, if you can, both hands if you can, and we're gonna stretch those up towards heaven. We're doing two things with that. The first thing we're doing is we're praising Jesus. We're making him bigger in our lives, and we're, we're giving him the glory. We're worshiping God when we do that. The second thing we're doing is a word called surrender. That means that we're giving Jesus our heart, we're giving him our attention, we're giving him our mind, we're, we're opening up ourselves to receive whatever he has for us. That's so good, you guys are doing awesome. Awesome. All right, now step four, the last and final step. Everybody shout step four. step four. Step four, this is the hardest one, but I know you guys can do it, all right? Step number four, with your eyes closed, hands lifted and face tilted up towards heaven, just as loud as you said step one, step two, and step three, and step four. What I need you to do is I need you to open up your mouth and we're gonna begin to talk to God. The first thing that we're gonna do is we're just gonna begin to tell God how good he is, okay? You don't have to use big words. 
act like he's your best friend, like he's right in front of you. So go ahead and lift up your hands and let's just begin to take a few moments just to glorify him right now. There you go, talk to him like he's your best friend. There you go, Jesus, I love you. God, you're so good. I know he can hear our thoughts, but he loves to hear your voice. That's it, guys, you're doing so good. There you go. God, I love you so much, Lord. You're so good. Jesus, you're so great. God, you're so cool. There's nobody like you, Lord. You are so awesome and so mighty. Thank you for loving me, Lord. Thank you for waking me up. Thank you for protecting me, Jesus. God, you are so wonderful, Lord. God, you are so good. That's it, kids, lift your voice. Keep those hands up. Lift your voice to them. God, you're so good. God, you're so great. God, you're so awesome, Jesus. That's it, guys. There you go. Lord, I love you. Now, as you're telling God how good he is, keep on praying. Keep on praying. Don't stop praying. But as you're telling God how good he is, what I want you to do is I want you to go ahead and start letting him know your need right now, okay? As you're saying, God, you're good, go ahead and let him know, God, Lord, I've been feeling so sad and I need some joy in my life, God. Lord, I, I, I want you to comfort me, Jesus. I want you to touch my grandma, God, and give her strength tonight. I need you to heal my uncle's body, Lord. God, I need you to bring my brother and my sister to church, Lord. Oh God, I want the gift of the Holy Ghost in my life. I want you to fill me with your spirit. If you're asking for the Holy Ghost, here's what I want you to do. I don't want you to beg for it because it's a gift. It's a gift, you don't have to beg for it. So if you're praying for the Holy Ghost, just start thanking God for it right now. Say, God, I thank you for the Holy Ghost. Lord, I thank you for your spirit. Thank you for loving me and wanting to fill me, Lord God. I give it all to you right now, Jesus. I give you everything right now. That's it, guys, keep praying, keep praying, keep praying. God, I love you, Jesus, I love you, Jesus. Come on, everybody, parents, ministry, if you're still here, if you wanna come up and help us pray, come help us pray in the name of Jesus. That's it, kids, that's it, that's it. Come on, God's listening to you, God's listening to you. That's it, hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Hallelujah, hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah, hallelujah. God, I love you, Jesus, I love you.
is here. to go to the back area um, for our fun activities. But if you're praying, keep on praying. Those activities will be there when you're done. Thank you for coming tonight.